you can turn from the judgments. I will strike your land with every imaginable destruction. I have warned and warned, but few hid my cause to repentance. It is about to unfold in ways no one can imagine. I have said it, and it will be so. Do not dare to say I will be gracious, for I come with a sword to strike the earth, and I will not relent. I have much against you. You murder indiscriminately your young. You toss their bodies in a heap. Some of you harvest to eat, and it is an abomination unto me. Soon you will understand what judgment by a holy and righteous God is. You will fall on your faces crying out to me. I will spare those I know by giving them the strength to endure, but they will not be unaffected. You will witness suffering, and you will be unable to remedy the suffering of those who are unrighteous. Now is the time of repentance. Now is the time to get clean before me. I will not withhold my hand from bringing judgment to the land in ways that no one has even given thought to. Come, my bride, and see the unrighteous bend to the force of judgment. Know that it is I, the Lord, who is bringing these things forth out of my mighty right hand. I could warn thousands of times, but some will still not bend their knee to the fury that will unfold. It is the unrighteousness that must be broken. I, the Lord, have stood by and waited so patiently, more patiently than any parent. I have waited, but still they walk with a crooked neck, bent for destruction. No more, I say no more. Judgment has already begun, but it will be obvious to everyone, not just my children. It will be so powerful that only the most prideful and wicked will deny it. I want an army of truth tellers. Will you march on with a song to me? Will you tell the neighbor about me? How about your coworker or your boss? What will you give an answer to? Will you love others enough to tell them that I am his coming to judge the earth in her sin? Will you share with them how to have a relationship with me? Or is that your secret? I need food soldiers to bear the banner of truth against this war culture. I made man and woman, not transvestites or transgender people. You cover up your flesh and recreate what was never intended. Enough is enough. Stop these abominations and stand up to protect your children, who they want to experiment upon. It is for wealth and power that they exert control over the youth. It is pure evil. It is a mutilation unto Baal and Molech. For shame to you, for allowing it to get as severe as it is. Why aren't people on mass taken to the streets to stop this? Why do you shake your heads and go back to your video games or shopping for trinkets? I am calling everyone to an account. The least you could do is pray and fast. Change begins with you. I love you children, but like any good parent, I must correct behavior that is amiss. And you have been incorrigible. Your nation has flipped all that is good, and then called it good. For they hate what is good and righteous. Even my children are addicted to pornography. Even my children entertain thoughts that are so impure that if they were exposed, some would commit suicide. I see everything, though they believe their sin is secret. It is not hidden from me. Repent. Repent and turn away. Renew your relationship with me. I will receive those who are truly sorry. When you are shown images that are unwholesome, Stop and turn the channel or website. If you are curious, come to me for answers and relief. I desire to make a proclamation. The doctrine, once saved, always saved, is a lie from the pit of hell. 
those who are in relationship with me will be saved. If you think because you walk the aisle and hate yourself, you are mistaken. I come to proclaim liberty to those who desire to serve and worship me alone. If something is more valued than a relationship with me, you are worshipping another god. It is that simple. Come, let us go to the house, the temple of my kingdom, the place I want to take your heart away. Those who serve will be rewarded in the next life. Seek first the kingdom. I love you each and every one. I must bring judgments for the abominations that are rampant in your land. Remain steadfast, and I will protect you from the worst of it. Some will die for the cause, but their reward will be great in heaven. Seek to emulate them. I adore those who make me their number one priority.